Welcome to the Bags Pack Family YouTube channel. I'm Jonathan, and in today's video, the entire family and Woo! I are heading into Costco. This is gonna be a Midwest Costco haul. And the main reason we're doing this is to support our life back in Indonesia. We are heading home soon, home to Indonesia, and we have an opportunity to grab a bunch of snacks and things like that that aren't typically available to us, at least in West Papua, Indonesia. A lot of this stuff you can get in Jakarta, but we don't live there. We're like six hours away from Jakarta by plane. So now is a chance to grab snacks. Kelly, are you looking forward to anything in particular in there? Oh yeah, lots. Um, we can get lots of dried fruit and nuts, but it's usually um, salt, like super salty, so yeah. I'm excited to see if there's some um, unsalted. They have that Kirkland unsalted brand, yes, which you guys saw us buy in Alaska. So uh, hopefully in the Midwest, I mean they would have certainly the Costco. I would think so. Kirkland brand. It'd be interesting to see what they have here. Compare the prices, especially to the Alaska Costco. And granted, are you looking forward to anything in particular? I want to get Costco pizza. Ah, the Costco legendary. And Forrest, what is something you're looking forward to uh, grabbing while we're in Costco? Uh, toy. Toy, huh? Well, you do have some uh, Christmas money from Nana, so that's a possibility. Cedar, yep. are you looking forward to anything in the back uh, from Costco? Uh, I don't know. Uh, it'd be interesting to see what's in there. Yeah. Could be all types of yummy surprises. Yeah. Okay, well, we are going to get in there and uh, show you what it's all about. We are definitely in the Midwest, man. It is just windy and cold. You guys, can you make it? Are you surviving? We're cold! You're the small one. You wore your jacket. <laughs> Go, buddies! <laughs> Uh, let's see how long it takes before I find something to buy. Costco. Okay, how about a TV? No, we're good on the TV front. We got that in Alaska. Yeah, we got that in the left. Okay, so you saw jellyfish on the TV. Yeah. Nice. Okay, so it is a Tuesday afternoon. It's 1230. Let's see how long this whole haul takes. Yeah. And uh, it's pretty busy, at least from the parking lot. Air fryer. Ooh. Now, yeah, pass I on that. I do want that, but not yeah. now. Man, there's so much good stuff already. Yeah. Okay, so immediately furniture, which we can pass on. Nope, we don't need that. No. Nope. Well, oh, we do need Ziplocs. Well, let's go to the Ziploc main section. section That's just an end cap. Okay, so I think the plan is really to go up and down all the snack aisles. Really, it's been so long since we've been to Costco. We might yep. go up and down every aisle and just start snagging up stuff. See what's new, see what the prices are, that kind yeah. of stuff. Yeah, I mean, that's a sweet end table, but we don't need that. Okay. <laughs> All right, so immediately these are freezers. When we go back to Alaska, oh, yeah. I do want to get one of these, um, these Hampton beaches. They're all over. Something about these storage units. Right now it's $349. I hear it's been a lot cheaper than that. But for right now, again, we're focusing on stuff that we can send to Indonesia. First item up for grabs, although not exciting. We are running low on AAA batteries and at $17.99 for this quantity, this is a far better price than what we get in West Papua, Indonesia. Before we leave the Timbak Pearl, we need to have a tree blackberries for $4.79. Chicken pot pie for dinner tonight, $23.86. You think that's going to be delicious? Yes. I think Nana's going to love it. Yeah. And Granite, what did you come up with? and cheese which is 11.30 okay so that's gonna be with dinner with yeah. the chicken pot pie yeah. and mac and cheese that's yeah. a that's a homey midwest meal right there yeah all right good score gotta replenish nana's supply uh 26 so we're not, we're not gonna fly a bunch of toilet paper back <laughs> to indonesia no 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 this is these are gonna stay here this is uh 30 rolls a apparently that's we a lot. apparently we poop a lot J just kidding just kidding our first opportunity for samples. You guys gonna dig in there? Hey, it looks like naan and hummus. Ooh, that sounds hey, delicious. Thank you. Give us a taste test. Mm. Mm. Actual yeah, nice. I mean, mm. that's the best part about Costco, is it not? That's really good. Yeah. Oh man, too bad we're leaving in less than a week because it'd be a perfect thing to grab at the beginning of a trip. It's like a big old thing of Costco hummus and hey, the uh, naan bread. All right, 13 gallon, 200 count of trash bags. This will take us at least until summer, at least six months worth. These are on sale, 16.79. Here's a gallon size of bug bags and 152 of them. And how much does it cost? Nothing. Nothing, they're free. Yeah. All right. Okay, check it out. 115 dishwasher pods for 11.49. Now that's 115, that's, how, that's three months worth, 30, 60, 90. It's just about four months worth. Should four we get, months worth. We Maybe two? we should get two. All right, better grab okay. two. 
All right, up next, one thing that seems like impossible to find even in Jakarta are those dryer sheets that make the clothes all soft and fluffy. Typically, I go Kirkland brand because they're cheaper, but the bounce sheets are actually on sale for $8.59, so we're gonna go with the bounce uh, brand of sheets this time. Okay, guys, it looks like we have fruit and veggie applesauce. Are you gonna, are you gonna try it? You should get different opposite colors. Okay. So you're going orange, orange, you go green, and you can switch. Forrest, you want a little applesauce? What apple? Mm, sort of on the fence. The green is really Green's good. Green's good. So green is uh, fruit and veg blend. Kale, green, green, kale, and apples. No added sugar. Orange is good. It's like sour. Sour? So yours is, um, well, I don't know. Let's see. No added sugar. I guess that's good. Yeah, whatever. Beets, carrots, it looks like. Apples, uh, yummy. Yeah. All right, yeah. recommended. Kid yes. approved. It's like sour and it's good. Yeah. Is it? Uh, is it daughter approved, Cedar? Yes. Nice. Uh, guys, what'd you find? We found Wish. Oh, uh, the like, cheese. Yeah. Yeah, they're like um, like astronaut yeah, food, really. Yeah, yeah. They're they're dehydrated. Dehydrated cheese. Good score. And it's uh, nine seventy nine. Yeah. Okay, nine seventy nine. Why don't you get two bags? We'll get four total. Uh -huh. We'll get two Parmesan, two cheddar. Uh -huh. And that's gonna be something that we'll just snack on while we're back in Indonesia. So it should be yummy. Good find, guys. So we just got those cheese wisps in the cart, and ta-da, there's a sample. Yeah. Ooh, I'm gonna jump that's in on those. Thank you. you. Forrest, you want a little cheese ball? Yeah, I'll take your glove off. There you go. You go ahead and taste one of those, see if they're yummy. That's good. Is it good? Are you glad we got them? Yeah. Cool. Is it just the Parmesan cheese or just the cheddar cheese? Cheddar. All right. Yes. Excellent. So, Forrest will eat that one. I'll eat this one. Should we grab a third pack or are we okay with two? It's okay with two. It's okay. Mmm. Delicious. I like it. You like it? Yum yum? Yeah. Good time. Mm -hmm. All right. So, yeah, man. Well, maybe I'll grab another pack, three packs each, because these are really good. It's like a fizzy one. Ooh. What flavor do you know? Um, so, it and just Wait, like one. this one is black cherry. Okay. Yeah. Okay, do you don't want it? No, so this is black cherry. Right. And this one is lime. This one is um grapefruit. And this one is black um render. So this is black cherry. What's this one again? That one is lime. That's super good. This one is lime. Ooh. Mmm. Really sour, but good. <laughs> sour but good? Thank you. Thanks so much. Yep. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, beef sirloin. Kind of one of my uh, favorite little snacks right here. Pretty good. I wonder if Forrest is going to want any. That's good. not even close. Quite good. That's good. That's good? All right, Forrest, you want the beef? Forrest, you like it? Up next is one of my favorite sections in the store. It's all about the coffee beans. Now, in our last Costco video, so many of you pointed out that we live in Indonesia, which is where so much coffee comes from but where we live specifically out in west papua it's a lot harder to get access to indonesian beans because everything's brought in and so for us it makes more sense to buy the quantity of beans here in the u.s and bring it back to indonesia with us now occasionally we do get indonesian beans when a specialty farmer brings stuff in but that happens kind of once in a while so we are kind of daily coffee drinkers so we're going to grab some of this stuff an organic two pound bag for 10.99 and we'll get a few bags of the coffee. So we'll get this one. We'll go with this Mexican blend. This is $16.99 for another two pounds. Medium roast. And what did you find? Check it out, Sumatra coffee. Wouldn't it be weird to buy Sumatra Indonesian coffee in the US and then bring it back to so Indonesia? So it went from Sumatra to America, back to Indonesia. Let's grab it. Yeah? Yeah, why not? Summer try. coffee sounds Organic. great. Oh, Sumatra coffee. Sumatra. Yum, yum. <laughs> All right, so that is two, four, six pounds of coffee. How is that steak? Delicious? All right. And it's the rest. Oh, yeah, get the rest. All right, what'd you find, Cedar? A little bit of pug mix. Oh, yes, it's a blend. All types of crunchy yummies. Cheetos. Pretzels. Some kind of crispy chip. Yep. All right, how much does that cost? $8.89. Not a bad deal. All right, toss it in the cart. Greta, what'd you find? <laughs> I found these pretzels, which is which look pretty good. It's like a twisty. Okay, like yeah, these are sometimes like buttery flavored, which yeah. I remember growing up eating those. Yum yum. It's How much is 9 .89. it? Nine eighty nine. Nine eighty nine. Not bad. Wait a second. No, it's cheaper. No, those are for. Yeah, this is. Oh no, this is the cinnamon sugars nine eighty nine. Yeah, but so it's a mystery. Flavor. Maybe it's nine eighty nine. We mm -hmm. could. We'll find out. Yeah. 
So these are like fig treats. It's called Nature's Bakery Fig Bar. And there's 20 blueberry flavor and 20 raspberry flavors. And we've had these before. Yeah, so these should last us. Now 40, think about this. So you're gonna eat a pack, Cedar's gonna eat a pack. So that goes down to 20 days. Why don't you grab two I of them? Those. Yeah, they're good, aren't they, Cedar? And what did you find over here, Cedar? These are Z bars. Okay, kids' cliff bars? Yes, there's 12 bars of chocolate chip, 12 iced oatmeal cookie, and 12 chocolate brownies. All right, want to grab two of those? Yes. Might as well, huh? Here, here, I'll grab it for you. All right, there you go. Boom, baby. Boom, baby. And P.S., these are $15.99. And Cedar, how much are those cliff bars? 12, uh, $21.89. Excellent. All right, our favorite organic peanut butter for $10.99 for two. And you saw us buy this in Alaska, uh, and we still have, I think we have one more. So we do burn through peanut butter fairly regularly, but I think with the one we have plus this two pack, that'll get us to summer. Yeah, we should be pretty good with that. All right, Forrest, what'd you find? Maple syrup. Excellent for $11.99. This is a staple. We always get two or three of these each time we're home because we burn through it so fast. Grab one more, dude. Let's take two. Nice job, muscles. Three pound bag of almonds for $8.99 and uh, unsalted. Those are going to be delicious. Not a bad deal. Yeah. And let's see what Grant's getting into over here. Ah, uh, yes. Seaweed. Excellent. For $9.99. Excellent. How many we got here? Two, four, six, eight. Wait, two, four, six, eight, ten. Not bad. Cool, dude. Good score. And what'd you find here, Forrest? The biggest, 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 really big chocolate chips. Yum. Chocolate yeah, chocolate chips. chips. Believe it or not, you saw us buy this bag in Alaska. Yeah, we burned cookies. it out really quick. Things like That's pancake it. cookies. You can make cookies. Are you going to make some cookies with mommy? Yeah. Yummy. All right, chocolate chips, ten ninety nine. Oh. And to go with those chocolate chips, we need crusties. This is a huge monster bag, four and a half pounds, and that is for $7.99. And believe it or not, we burned through our last one pretty oh, quickly yeah. from Alaska, so this is just replenishing to get us to summer. A new item for us, at least, are these pre-cooked bacon crumbles shelf stable. The last time we were at Costco in Alaska, I brought a bunch of bacon on the plane. Now that got to Indonesia just fine. The problem is we're not going straight to Indonesia. We're going via Thailand. We'll spend some days there. That's a kind of insider for you guys. But either way, this is gonna last off shelf, no refrigeration needed. So I'm gonna actually get a few of these. They are $8.99 each. I'm gonna grab, I think I'm, I'm, thinking I'm gonna go for it, Grant. I'm gonna grab like four of these. Is that good with you? Yep. Thumbs up, dude. Let's grab them. We're in Indonesia full time right now. Oh, How's the seaweed sandwich? We're, at, we're actually teachers yeah. at an international school in West Papua, Indonesia. Nice. So we've been there for four years. Oh, that's good. And we're stocking up all the all the supplies we're getting in the cart now. Yeah. We're going to mail it to Indonesia. Oh, so we have a free nice. shipping thing with one of the companies. Seaweed. That's great. We there. Yep. The seaweed's actually a snack for Nana's house oh, here. Okay. <laughs> but everything else going to Indonesia. So you came in for Christmas? Yes. Came in for yeah. Christmas and New Year's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's well, really well, nice well. to be home. Thank yeah, you. Thank it's good you. to be back. The samples are endless here at Costco. So what, what do we have here, Cedar? Uh, chickpea pasta. Chickpea pasta. That's right on. So that's got to be gluten free. Yes. That's like the big, uh, yeah, the big, uh, the big catch on the gluten free, yeah? And that is really good. Does it taste like regular pasta? Yeah, basically. Cool. Yum. But it tastes really good. Get approved? Mm -hmm. All right, so uh, Bonanza, yum yum. Okay, I feel like suspicion is happening here. Three, two, one, go. Uh, Forrest, what do you dog. got there, dude? The big hot dog. Yeah. Wow. Boom, baby. Beef summer sausage, gluten free, no MSG. Okay, sounds good to me. Let's grab that, huh? I think $12.99. Now, are we going to send that to Indonesia or are we going to eat that here? I think we should send it to Indonesia. Well, that's not going to last very long. Uh, I want to better get Nana. two. Better get two. Okay, twelve ninety nine for the beef sausage. Boom, yeah. baby. Woo. Shelf stable. That's even Shelf better. Stable. Cool. Go. Thanks, guys. Good score. Now, granted, you are at an interesting space here. What are we looking at? Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese, original craft. I mean, not even the organic one over there. You're you're going straight old school. Yep. Powdered cheese. Dried cherries, $7.99. Yes, $7.99. And um, this will be yummy to add to oatmeal and some uh, chia pudding that we might be making. We have to have dried mangoes. Now we burned through those. So how many bags do you think we're gonna get? Three. Three? Yeah, that's a good call, good call. And how much are they? $17.99. Per bag. All right, Cedar, what do you got? 
applesauce and cinnamon. Yum. 1999. And how many are in there? 48. That'll last quite a while. All right, good, good score. More samples. What do you got? Oh, I've had those before. But they're a little caramel on the inside. Those are good. Yeah, the, these are bought a lot at Starbucks in Dubai. Uh, and flowers. So nice. All right, guys, what'd you come across? These like fruit sticks, kind of. Nice. Yeah, pure organic. $12. Okay. $12. You like that? Maybe. So what, what are the ingredients? Is there added sugar, or is it all just like fruit and oh. stuff? Real fruit purees, real fruit juices, no artificial flavors, organic, mm -hmm. gluten-free, vegan, non-GMO. All the good stuff we like. So we so. got uh, apple puree, passion fruits. Yeah, it looks uh, looks pretty good. Yeah. Right? Why not? Try it out. Okay, how many boxes? Uh, no, but this is a six month supply, guys, so it's again, not just a week. Like, uh, there's about, what do we got? 28, 28 in a box? 28. So. Looks like you're holding three boxes, sounds so about right. About three boxes. All right, sounds good. Yeah. Okay, now, granted, I see you're holding these bare fruit roll ups. What's yeah. the story? What's the history of you in these? So, we've always had these in Dubai, and they're always perfect. So, I think we're going to get them. Yep. And one box is $10.99. Let's grab, let's go ahead and grab two boxes. So, we, uh, so it's 48 per box. Boom, baby. So we're getting to the, uh, it's embarrassing to be seen with this much food stage, but this is a six month supply of food. And just over here is all the beef jerky stuff. So we're gonna load up on some of that. What do you think, Cal, beef jerky? I'm looking for tofu jerky. Tofu jerky, we'll keep an eye out, but uh, <laughs> Granite and I will uh, hit this up pretty hard. All right, so Granite and I did a little research down the list of ingredients on all these beef jerkies. So many of them are filled with like sugar and coloring and all this kind of stuff, but and we did corn find- syrup. And corn syrup, good, 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 good. But we decided on these, and why do you think this is the best choice? Because there's like zero sugar added into it, and it's grass fed, so, and, we found others, but they're the same price, but these ones are tinier and more of them, so we want more quantity yeah. in the bag, and they're more portion control as they're like little snack size. Yeah. So I think we should get at least three of these, do you think? Yeah. Okay, 28 per bag. These are not inexpensive. They're $16.59 per bag, so we'll, we'll get three. Six months supply. Check it out. I got these. These only have two ingredients. It's called That's It. Two ingredient bars. They're kind of like dried fruit mushed together into a bar shape. And this is $13.99 per bag. So it's a little more than the fruit puree bars that we just got, but it's like whole food. And there's only two ingredients that are, what is it? Apples and strawberries or apples and mangoes or apples and blueberries. So yes. we are definitely gonna load up on these. You must have seen in the other video that I got pumpkin seeds, but we went through them so fast with all my salads that um, organic pumpkin seeds for $8.99, I'm gonna get two bags. Good find. <laughs> Shelled pistachios, $14.49, I'm gonna get two bags for uh, snacking on. All right, quite the haul. Now I think everyone is uh, a bit hungry. Forrest, you want a pizza? Little pizza? All right, we're gonna grab some snacks here at the snack bar. All right, Green, are you gonna order us up some lunch? Yes, I'm just gonna order one slice of pepperoni because they have huge slices. Okay, who's that for? That's for me. Okay, go ahead and get Cedar, get everybody. So Cedar, what she wants? She wants cheese pizza? Cheese, mama wants cheese, and Forrest wants cheese. Okay, so that's four slices of pizza. You? Uh, I'm gonna probably go with a hot dog. Boom, okay, all right. Forrest, you doing good? You ready for some pizza? All right, I think is that everything? Yeah, I think so. All right, cool. It's like the cheapest thing in Costco, 946. All right, snack time, total hit. Guys, Costco pizza just as good as you remember? Yeah. Yum, Forrest. You got a big old piece of cheese there, mister. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we're going to enjoy the snacks. We're going to head home, lay it all out, show you everything that we purchased. Talk about total price here in just a minute. All right, so it ended up being a pretty good Costco haul. Now, everything we bought here was with the intent that we're going to try to get it to last many, many months. So this is not like a normal what we'd buy at Costco. But again, this is to get us through until summertime out of Indonesia. So just to kind of break down everything we bought so far. Okay, a lot of this is school lunch, school snack themes. So we've got all the little applesauce packets. We've got these little cheese puffs that goes with these cheese puffs here. We have the uh, dried cherry snacks, chocolate chips, almonds, seaweed, bounce sheets for the dryer. And then we're getting into more of the snack stuff again with the uh, little uh, meat sticks, beef sticks, some fruit snacks. We've got the organic dried mangoes, pretzels, Four, we ended up with four bags of bacon bits. Granite, 
Is it, do we get enough bacon? Yes. Kelly, do we get enough bacon? Ha! <laughs> Not. I agree with you. Not enough. <laughs> So four bags. Cedar, looking forward to some bacon? Yeah. Good girl. All right. So we continue on with the pretzels. The uh, pub mix. Cedar picked out the pub mix. Oh, yeah. That's Cheetos pretty good stuff. Like Cheetos. And yeah. That'll be good. You, just, you basically put that on, you snack on it. So, like, yummy there. That'll be good. Yeah, I think so. More fruit bars. This is, again, school lunch snacks, after school stuff. Same with the uh, Z bars, the little fruit roll-ups. You've seen us buy these before. Three bags of coffee. My favorite one is this Sumatra because, you know, it will be the furthest traveling coffee beans in the world, I think, from Indonesia to America, back to Indonesia. Uh, we've got the fig bars. Granted, pick those out. We've got the two-pack of peanut butter. That's to continue what we already bought in the last Costco video from Alaska. A few maple syrups, some beef summer sausages. This will be what we put out when we have friends over and just kind of snacky stuff. I'm going to pivot over here. We ended up getting forced a couple of sets of pajamas, so that'll be nice for him. The dishwasher pods, Ziploc baggies, garbage bags, toilet paper. That's to resupply what we've used since we've been here in America, so we're not actually sending that to Indonesia. We did end up with a few items that are going to be uh, used here. So we got a big chicken pot pie. That costs $23.86. We've got the mac and cheese at $11.30 and a few berries. So this will be dinner tonight, maybe a snack later. So pretty good haul so far. I think so. Yeah, it kind of represents like the typical I'm stuff, sure we're gonna be just like, more. oh, we forgot this one thing, or oh, I wish we Every time. one other thing, but um, I think we have plenty right now. And we still have a few more days, so we can always run back. Okay, so continuing on, Kelly got the uh, sprouted organic pumpkin seeds. That'll be for snacking and salads. Granite was a uh, diehard for the 18 boxes of mac and cheese. Krusty's pancake batter, that is so heavy, 10 pounds. Yeah, that's, that's a heavy load. All right, yeah, no joke. Pistachios, a couple of battery, AAA batteries, and then we're back to the beginning. So all this is the Costco haul. Now, you're probably wondering how in the world are we going to get all this back to Indonesia? Typically, we fly with big duffel bags, and we kind of distribute the weight, and it's just a pain in the backside to like get it all there, but we do it. But this time, we're actually going to Thailand. And again, that's a little inside baseball for you. So we are going to have a big Thailand playlist coming up. So instead of carrying all this to Thailand for a couple of weeks, what we're going to do is we have a shipment allowance. And there's a, a UPS distributor near Kelly's mom's house, which is where we are right now uh, in the winter here. So we're going to take all of this to the UPS store and ship it to Indonesia. And I have a feeling that this will be within our allowable weight limits and allowance. So we're, we're looking pretty good that way. But we are going to attempt to mail all of these items from the Midwest here to Indonesia. So we'll let you know how it goes in a future video. But I think, I think we'll find success. So we've done a pretty good job uh, with everything. Okay, now the moment of truth. How much did this Midwest Costco haul cost? All right, anyone want to take a shot? Granite, you want to take a guess? $200. Okay, 200 bucks. Cal? I'm going to say 500 500 Okay, Cedar? Um, maybe. Hmm. It's pretty big. It's pretty big. Yeah. $250. $250. All right, total price. You guys are all kind of extremely low. As I hate to say it. Yeah. But the total Costco haul price eight hundred forty five dollars and fifty six cents so, that's uh, again more than uh a little but it certainly represents a long stretch so you know if you break it down i bet this will last us at least two months so if you look at it that way eh, maybe a little more manageable all right everybody we are building an entire u.s playlist please jump on board check out a bunch of those videos especially if you're into costco we got a lot of stuff from alaska we have a huge international playlist as well from a variety of countries. Feel free to check out those videos. Uh, do like and subscribe. It helps support the channel, helps us grow. And everyone, we will see you in the next episode.